Hey, Psst. who is it? Hey, it's me, Cheetal. Wow, I must be dreaming. Cheetal, my old friend, have you admitted defeat? Willing to let me devour you without putting up a fight? I will never give up, Tigress. I'm just warning you about the dangers of preying uncontrollably on us, Cheetal dear. What nonsense! We predators are a necessary part of the ecosystem. We keep you herbivores from overpopulating the planet. All I know is that you tigers have been nothing but a danger to our lives. How could you possibly be anything less than a threat to our species? Think about the phenomena of co-evolution, Cheetal. Every population has its fair share of organisms born at the shallow end of the gene pool. In the case of your population, it would be the deer that are slow or have poor reflexes. When we tigers prey on your kind, they are the ones that get eliminated. We rid your population of those who are unfit to contribute their genes to the next generation. How is this co-evolution, tigress? Our population is cleansed of slow deer, but what about the tiger population? The same with ours, Cheetal. The slow tigers that are unable to hunt well, starve and die when they cannot run as fast or outwit you, Cheetal. Just as we rid the population of slow and unfit deer, the faster and agile deer make it such that only the fit population of tigers can survive. You make us better hunters, too. You don't see me complaining that you, Cheetal deer, run too fast and I have to keep up with you. I see how co-evolution works. Both of our species need to keep evolving and getting better and better in order to survive. Does this mean that we will get faster and faster? Oh, definitely. My children are already much faster than my ancestors were. And if they were not, chances are that they would not survive and they will have to give way to others who are fitter than they are. Cheetal. Yes! I feel the need, the need for speed. I feel it too. Catch me if you can. Gladly. Nothing personal. It's just part of our relationship. See ya.